Click on the blank rack space beneath the read room so that the new device will be created at the bottom of the rack. Select Dr. Rex Loop Player from the Create menu. Because the device is created at the bottom of the rack, it will automatically be cabled into the mixer. Like the read drum, the Dr. Rex player must have a Rex loop loaded before it creates any audio signal. Click on the Browse button to open the file browser. Navigate to the factory sound bank and open the Dr. Rex loops directory. Select the file House 25 Tribe Hats and load it into the Dr. Rex player. Click on the Preview button to audition the loop file. Click on the Preview button again to stop the audio. Recycle loops are special files since they contain both audio sample data and MIDI sequence data. By pressing the To Track button, the MIDI sequence data is extracted from the Rex loop and imported to the sequencer. Now when the sequencer plays, the MIDI sequence data will trigger each of the loop slices in the Rex file. By switching to edit mode, you can visually see the MIDI slice data of the recycle loop file. One simple change to rearrange the percussion loop is to delete the slices near the end of the phrase. Zoom in on the sequencer and then scroll the sequencer to bar 16 1, 1. Use the selection tool in the sequencer and set the resolution to 16th notes. Next, select all of the slice events in bar 16 and delete them. When the 16 bar phrase nears the end transition, the percussion loop will drop out completely, letting the snare roll introduce the transition.